It's been an extremely sad day across Connecticut, but there's been an overwhelming amount of love and support for Lieutenant Dustin DeMonte and Sergeant Alex Hamsey. I spoke to the limo driver for Lieutenant Dustin DeMonte's parents this morning, and he says, of course, while it was a difficult ride, the support from the community was felt inside that car. Incredible. Fighting through tears, Ken Twombly says his heart stopped when Lieutenant Dustin DeMonte's parents first got in his limousine Friday morning. His father sat right up front alongside me, and it was emotional. What was a difficult road to their son's funeral at Wrenchler Field in East Hartford was also filled with love from thousands of strangers. A love so strong it stretched inside the car. He teared up a couple of times and so did I. <laughs> I couldn't help it. You know, you see all these firefighters with their flags on the overpasses. His father said Dustin loved his job but knew what he was getting Hello. into. And uh, we just kept commenting all the way up. We couldn't see the front of the motorcycle line. A sea of blue and red flashing lights in a massive procession line. In that moment, Lieutenant DeMonte's father, Philip, without many words, shaking his head in disbelief. People getting out and saluting and filming and the respect that they were paying was, was phenomenal. In all ages, it didn't matter. Everybody cared about this. It was the stories Philip told of his son that showed just how proud the DeMonte family is of their fallen hero. Mostly about his son, uh, how dedicated he was, what a great kid he was. Uh, we talked about his calling hours last night a little bit, how, it, how it, his father's 95-year-old mother was there and managed to sit through it. A ride unimaginably painful, somehow made comfortable by people like Ken, who loved the fallen officers and their families like their own. It was just allowing him to reminisce because that's what people need to do if someone suddenly passes away. They need to talk about that person. That was an extremely emotional and difficult interview, but he says he's hopeful he was able to provide a small sense of comfort to Lieutenant DeMonte's parents in that moment. And he says, although he can't speak for them, it was clear the impact the support had on them today. In East Hartford, Lindsay Kane, Fox 61 News.